Okay. So if we open this up, This is just telling you how to do it. We're going to use the 4RS system, and these are the sections of the textbook, 14.29 to 14.31. So this kind of also, you just kind of look over stuff, skim through it, read the sections, get the main ideas, and then write your notes on the 4R note paper, um, which I'll show you in a minute. So what the for our note paper looks like, there's the respiratory system. You're just going to label the parts, just click in the box and type. Here's your for our note paper. So you would just type the subject in. This would be page one. Your notes would go in here. And then you use this summary recall as a way to test yourself. So they could be, you could have them in the form of questions or just topics however we want to do it. So when you're studying, you cover up the main idea with a piece of paper or something, and then can I answer what I have in the summary recall section? So it's kind of like flashcards, but in the form of notes is kind of how that for our note system works. And then at the bottom here, um, this is for writing out questions that you think your teacher might ask. So just like questions you think I might ask on a test. That's what you put at the bottom there on that, like pertaining to this page. And then there's two pages there. You should be able to get the notes in two pages. Um, Cause I'm trying to get you to summarize the information not write out the textbook. Okay. And then here's the outline. So the, these are the headings that are in the, in the textbook basically. And then the marks beside, these are just the marks for doing the notes on that section. In brackets there. So if you go to the online textbook, you'll see these headings basically, or close to it. Is there any questions on that? So you want to try and summarize the notes, like don't copy out the textbook. You'll get graded on how complete yet summarized your, your um, notes are. If you copy out the textbook, then you won't get as good a mark because you're not summarizing it. Okay. And does everybody know where the textbook is? I go here. Yeah. Yeah. So here's the course textbook just underneath the calendar. If you click this link, it doesn't ask to say that it's just if you're already a member, it just kind of takes you there to the class and then click on the, the, um, this is the textbook or shared resources and then the textbook. Then you'd go there and then you want to go to 14. And this sometimes takes a while to load. 14, two, nine was the first one right there. You're doing these three. And then you'd have to hit start. And then you would just start. Now, I think these um, take you to uh, definition. It's bolded. Oh, just things on the, yeah. If you want, you need to know more. But anyhow, we're doing the blood later on, but we're just going to do how the lungs deliver oxygen and get rid of carbon dioxide now. But that is what, and then so you're going to work on that today and tomorrow. And then um, I have a class. No, I don't because I have it today. No class tomorrow because you're just working on the notes. If you need help, though, you're welcome to come into school. Any Wednesday, you can come in um, if, you, if you feel you need to. 
So today's a Zoom class, lesson one, you're gonna finish up your notes and then you're gonna move on to lesson two. And let's go to lesson, there we are. Okay. And then you have lesson two, which is you're gonna, um, Uh, watch this video. Now, I'm not sure. I think I might have forgot to print this page off. So you might just have to write it on some scrap paper for now. Or print, if you have a printer, you can print it off. Or if you come in tomorrow, you can get it. Um, I can't remember if I printed that off or not for you guys. Does anyone remember? Looks like this. Do you remember if you got that or not? I don't think so. Okay. So you'll have to, if you come in tomorrow, you can pick it up. If not, you'll just have to print it at home. If you don't have a printer, then I don't know. If you can write on here online, that would work too. But we are doing kind of diagrammy stuff, so it might be hard to do that unless you have a tablet or something with a pen. Okay. Let's go back to our calendar. Yeah. Okay. This Zoom class on Monday, we're doing the lung capacity lab. Attendance is really important there because it helps with our lab because we're doing a correlation. So we need numbers from everybody on um, what their lung capacity, surface area, and um, what, you, you, what you think your fitness level is. So, and whether you smoke or not, or how many cigarettes you smoke a day. So we just kind of need to collect that data from the class, your, your name won't be attached to the data. So, and then, um, yeah, but that's, and you got a balloon in your folder for that lab. You will also need, it'd be good to have a calculator and a um, centimeter ruler for that lab. If you're really stuck and don't have a ruler, come see me tomorrow and I can maybe lend you one if I can find any. Okay. Is there any questions on that? I'll have to get this organized. I thought I already did it. Already. So get the nutrition assignment done and start working on those notes. And if you have questions, you can come in tomorrow, but otherwise you're kind of working on the note assignments. You don't have to come in if you don't feel like you need to. Okay. It'll just be more of a drop-in basis tomorrow. Any questions on any of that? You guys are very quiet. <laughs> okay. <laughs>